What is going on guys, my name is Mehul and welcome to your third Angular 2 tutorial in which I'm going to show you how to write a hello world program in TypeScript. Well, basically, besides hello world, what I'll be teaching you is that how to basically set up the development environment for TypeScript and Angular 2. Well, for TypeScript, it's a bit different and uh, it's a bit techy as well, so you might like it. So let's just go back to our old friend the documentation and let me just click on get started you select here angular 2 for typescript and i'm just gonna follow each and everything in the documentation only because this is simple and easy to understand so yes we have already set it up sublime text for typescript and if you haven't then i guess you don't need to either because we will be making use of a light server here I guess um, this one so you just have to make sure that TypeScript is installed so to install TypeScript you have to just do in command line npm install TypeScript or you can just you know just omit that as well because TypeScript is included in developer dependencies so it would automatically install it for you if you haven't so let's just copy this package.jsun file and I guess we have missed a file here so first of all let's just do this tsconfig config.jsun and this TypeScript configuration file is the file which tells the command line or whatever we'll use to compile our TypeScript code that how the target should be compiled so for example we want it to be an ES5 compiled file after compiling the TypeScript then this is module system these are some things source map emit decorator metadata true remove comments false no implicit any false and like that and this exclude is probably that you don't want to compile the already built-in TypeScript files in these folders well we don't have these folders for now but we'll have in a minute so the next thing just copy this typings.json file typings.json and here you go now all of these are some sort of dependencies you need before getting started then we have this package.json and if I just copy and paste this right there package.json now you could actually omit um, you know this TypeScript right there if you already have installed it because I guess I have installed that TypeScript version we okay so I have 1.7.5 but I guess the latest one is 1.8.2 so you might consider that but I'm just gonna leave it for now because I already have that so yeah so I have just deleted that line and yeah you could probably install everything else now these scripts would be beneficial for us to you know just it will just save our time a bit for example we'll just see in a minute that when you are just doing your work and save then you don't need to recompile and rebuild every file it would automatically do it for you so these scripts would be handy well the next thing uh, these are just the snippets and it says to do an npm install all right so okay so first of all let's just navigate to this folder right there hold right hold the shift and click right click and just open command window or git bash i'm gonna just open command window right there and right here i'm gonna say npm install hit enter and wait for it so i'm just gonna pause the video here and once it's done i'll resume all right so once you're done with this you'll see these two folders two new folder node modules and typings and yeah so once these two are visible to you let's just continue again all right so now it is saying us to create an apps of folder so 
you can either create that or you can just skip the step if you just want to keep it on in the same directory but if it's saying that that means that it will keep us organized a little bit so let's just create one so okay now add a component file now components is something we'll be discussing real soon but not for this tutorial again because that won't be a hello world tutorial if I started discussing that so this would be whatever you like it to app.ts so all right well moving further then we have this main.ts which is just bootstrapping this again you can just paste it paste it right there only it wouldn't make any difference just paste them just omit this line and paste it here just omit this line and just bootstrap it but let's just separate the things out so that it's easy to debug later on main.ts and all right now we have finally this index.html all right so yeah so we need to create one index.html here you go now inside here again we don't need these three because we aren't using ie but if you are really pushing it on your web server then you'll surely want to include that no need for this as well so this is what this thing is doing is that it is just um, compiling basically it's not compiling actually it is just making use of the compiled main.ts file in your application so yeah so what we need to do next is pretty much I guess we are done so yeah all right so yeah so we are pretty much done with the setup and if I just go to terminal again and say npm start all right now as you can see we see a bunch of compiled files here so this main.js main.js.map app.js and app.js.map wasn't there previously but they magically came from somewhere when I just run that command npm start so yeah now this is probably not loading I guess okay so I guess I we had a name change right there main is good yeah so this one is minus just app so now as you can see I didn't even reload this it automatically just you know just it automatically restarted the server for me and it's as you can see it is on localhost so if I just down a little bit and as you can see right there a little bit more and if I just change this thing right there to let's just say hello angular 2 from TypeScript and save this you can see it automatically changed I didn't need even need to restart the server and it is actually running on server so you will have access to all the things like you know making ajax request and all that stuff you will actually do on a live website so that's how you basically get started with angular 2 and typescript so yeah so that's all for this tutorial and i'll see you then in the next one real soon don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching